teachers and members of several other units units are out picketing tonight and the simple term we're using is respect it covers a number of areas we're trying to deal with one of the biggest things we realized late in the contract season was that the board of education had provided the superintendent with a $257,000 bonus. Now they don't call it a bonus, but that's essentially what they did. So for this year, the superintendent is eligible to receive a little over $500,000 in compensation. While most teachers and other individuals assigned to the unions are going to receive 1% for this year only. We have no idea what the future will bring, but quite honestly, our situation is, is a person who's eating a bologna sandwich realizing that the person who's serving it to them is actually eating filet mignon. We don't think it's fair, we don't think it's a good way to go, and we certainly don't feel respected. Teachers feel abused and neglected. They're upset. They're not getting the respect from the board and from the superintendent that they feel that they have earned, and they are upset and angry. Uh, things with the contract, um, what the superintendent got is his new contract. There's a gross inequity between what leadership is being paid and what the people who do the work in the trenches are being paid. It's not equitable and it's not fair. While students are now in larger classrooms, they're seeing less time from teachers because teachers are being asked to do more work and given less time and less pay for the work that they have to do. They can't do everything that's required of them within their contracted hours. It's important for us to be out here to support the teachers union over this lavish contract that's been awarded to the school superintendent of Anne Arundel County. While the teachers suffer and other public employees suffer, he walks off with a pay raise and other great benefits that no one else is getting. We definitely want to support the teachers. We believe the teachers, police and firefighters need all everyone's support right now. We are here because teachers in this county do not get the respect that we deserve. We are here working with students of Anne Arundel County and we're trying to make this county from good to great and we do not get the respect of our board. Our superintendent has uh, received quite a handsome package and we have been furloughed. Our superintendent has not. I'm looking for the respect that teachers deserve. We've um, increased our class sizes. We we're working really hard, um, doing a lot of extra stuff. We just want to be recognized for that. Um, the children are losing in our classrooms because the classes are so large, we can't give them the individual attention that they deserve um, to be able to service them as best we can. Good evening, President Nally, Vice President Burge, members of the board, Dr. Maxwell. For the record, I'm Tim Minuti, speaking for the organization, the PAC, I'm the president. Anyone outside prior to the meeting would have seen the respect signs being held by school employees. You've also seen the ad purchased by the Coalition of Educational Employees, so you know the significance of the colors. We've read your response in the subsequent press release. I'm here tonight to state simply that our actions are the result of the offense taken by those who have absorbed sacrifices in the face of a very difficult budget year. Those sacrifices, however, have not been shared. As one of our members stated earlier today, it's hard to accept it as a bologna sandwich when the person feeding it to you is dining on prime rib. Thank you and good evening.